And the 2-2, another jam shot, slow roller up to third base and picked up. Ethan Venable won't have a play. Up to the plate. We saw Sam. One. Another check over at first, and this one gets away. Trying to take second base is going to be Max Staub, and the throw is in. And Sam Staub takes ball four. First and second for New Jersey here. On a Jason enjoys playing golf and playing. Jackson Serma delivers. And this one skied out to shallow left field. Cole Boyke comes in to make the catch for the first out for ball one. 3-2. High ball four. And the bases are going to be juiced for New Jersey with one out here in the top of the first inning. 2-2-1. Two, two and one. Drew Kirk be 14 years old. Payoff again. Called strike three. Instead, it's strike three. This one lined off the bat of Frankie Gravina, and it's caught on the line. Cole Boyke is there to record the final out. So Jackson. All right, welcome back. Here's a look at the starting lineup for the team from Taylor, Michigan, in the championship game to secure the win. But Asian teacher and is also a high school baseball coach, Mom. And the one, two. That's right there, called strike three. Max Staub with a strikeout. 13 years old, his dad, Todd, played in the... And a curveball slapped the other way into the hole at short. Knocked down by Drew Kirkby. The throw not in time. An infield sink. Favorite athlete, Bryce Harper. One of the Junior League World Series against Hawaii. Square to bunt. Runner taken off to second safe there is Cole with a stolen base. Also pitched five innings in relief and didn't allow a single hit. This one's grounded over towards second base. Ethan Bertou will take care of it for the second out of the inning. Up to third. It's either be a Major League Baseball player or... If it... Line drive, left center field. And it's over the head of Jason Warmer. First run's good for him, and it makes it one to nothing. Michigan. The middle. Jackson Serma didn't miss it. He'll head back out on the mound in the second inning with at least a one nothing. And he grounds this one back to the mound. Snagged by Max Stoppel, taking a first. And that will do it, but not before the RBI double for Jackson Serma. And it rain delay in between. Seems here today as Tommy Eichner leads it off, and he lines one out to right field, ranging back on it is Atkins, and he makes the catch for the first out of the inning. And Joe Luciano behind Owen. And he hits this one sharply towards third base. Ethan Venable up with it across the diamond. Nice play for the second out of the inning. Sebastian Fernandez went one for two. Fastball chopped over towards short. Lucas Farner throws to first in a clean inning for Michigan defensively. A one two. Max Staub back out on the mound. Needed 16 pitch. Line drive on the ground towards second. Here's Ethan Bertu. Smooth over there at second base is Ethan. Little League World Series championship game for Michigan. And this one lifted down the first base side. Sam stopped the first baseman, makes the grab. Wonder if that's a recent addition because of his no hitter. And a fly ball out to shallow right. Ethan Ratu has it covered. Three up, three down to one, two, three inning. Worked by Matt. It's going to be 10, 11, and one. Due up in the New Jersey batting order. First pitch swinging. Justin Morgan off the pitcher. Serma down to throw to first. The stretch was there. Nice. Junior League World Series, not only a couple of the best players in baseball. And that's going to be a walk for Ethan Ratu. Back to the top of the order, Max Staub now. 0 2 count to lead off man, Max Staub. And a curveball hit on the ground towards third base. Ethan Venables only plays to first. Gets the out there. Ethan Ratu is on the move. Two outs for twin brother Sam Staub now. Called strike three. Got the outer corner to Jackson Serma. 
for his second strikeout of the game. One of the strongest kids on the team, 14 years old, 5'10". The kid. And this one skied high into shallow center field. And the second baseman, Ethan Bratou, is there to make the catch. In the top of the third. Another young payoff on the way. And high and away, ball four. And a one-out walk. First walk of the day, actually, issued by... Rolled over towards third base. Luciano will throw to first, and Schufeld now looking to come home. Here comes the play at the plate, and plenty. Frankie asking for it up, gets it there, and it's taken out to right field. Tommy Eichner is there to drop it. And outfield for New Jersey. Allows the second run of the game. The heel of the glove there for Tommy. And Michigan with a 2-0 lead. Here's a fly ball out to left field this time. Evan Gallucci makes the catch. And that will end the inning. Coming back to the plate with just one hit for three innings so far. And this one first pitch swinging and caught on a line by Max LaForest at first. In the first, he has walked one since. Swing and a miss on the changeup there for Jackson Surma. Two gone. The first game of the day, coming from behind in the bottom of the seventh, they scored two runs. So three strikeouts, three walks through three and two thirds. Highlight of this last season was the comeback win over Tom's River East in the New Jersey State Tournament. And he singles one out to center field, two out base hit. He's on first. The only other hit in the game was from Matt for tomorrow. This one hit in the air. Out to right center field and won't be caught. Good effort. Or here. Big golfer as well. Runner taken off down to second. The throw goes there from Cam Thornton and they got a run down. And that's going to be close. I believe the run came. That would make sense. So Cam Thornton, Jackson Surma. That'll be ball four. Second walk of the game issued by Max Staub. Runner taken off. Here's the throw down. It's high. And off the base now back on is Cam. Ethan Ratu was there to back it up. On second to third. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. Perfectly located for Max Staub. His second strike. Here's Jacob Furcus, grounded out to the pitcher to end. Runner taken off to third. Little hit and run play here. Fly ball to left. Gallucci makes the catch. The throw back to second. Line drive to left field. That's going to get down for a base hit. Cam Thornton's going to score easily on an RBI base hit for Ethan Vail Series here at the plate. Able to score another run for Michigan. The throw comes in from Gallucci. Are always trouble. Max Dobb, the 2 2. It's high. Runner taken off to third. The throw is high. Head first dive, and he's safe. And Bell on third with a stolen. So now a 3 2 count. And outside ball four. Well, we've seen the defense for him. 1-1. One, one. Back to the pitcher's mound. Fielded by Staub. He'll take it to first to end the inning. Michigan gets another run across at the plate. Remember, he was at the plate. Lucas Farner here this Junior League World Series. Swing and a miss. Got a strikeout to Tommy Eichner. Good start. League World Series and now six at bats. This one hit the other way towards first, down to get it. Max LaForest will take it himself. So eight pitches to Judge, also the person that he would like to meet the most. And the 1-0 pitch lined out to left field and caught. Boyke was there to make the grab. And Chauncey Atkins will be due up here in this inning. Favorite move. 
And a curveball lifted out to left center. And the catch made on the run out there by Gallucci. One gone. Oh. It'll be tonight at 8 Eastern time on ESPN+. Plus. That's a called strike three. Two gone. Called strike three, Max Staub, 84 pitches through five. It needed only 10 pitches to do so in the fifth. As the 2-2 gets delivered, a check swing. Yes, he did. Second strike out of the game here today. And we're down to your final five outs here, if you're counting the top to back even, two and two. And this one flied out to center field. Going back on it is Ferkus, and he makes the catch. Two gone. Fly ball, shallow center, right behind second base. Now coming in is the shortstop, Cam. For Michigan, looking for some insurance here. Lucas Farner out to right field, dumps one in for a single. So he retired maximum threshold as Cole Boyke was one for two, squares to bunt. Gets it down, back to the mound, bobbled by Stop and throw to first just in time. In the plate. And moved over to shortstop. The balls. 2-2. Two -two. Flared out to shallow center field. And the catch is made. Warmer was charging in. He is working in at bat. And he does. Skied high behind home plate. Frankie Gravina won't have a play on it. The plate. Last batter for Max Staub, and he finishes him off with a strikeout. Staub able to work through six innings as the start. Max trying to help out his brother, this time at the plate. Lucas, he's retired all six. One, two, breaking pitch, called strike three. It's a huge first out, now Jason Warmer. Will take a strike on the outer part. And thrown strikes. Everything's going right for you on the mound. It's just going right. Chop back to the pitcher's mound. Farner will underhand toss to first, two away in New Jersey. Down to their final out. Called strike one. Evan is 0 for 1 today. This is a smart timeout called by manager Chris. And a curveball hit to the ground, second base. Ewell throws to first, out of it. Michigan advances to the U.S. Championship game. Star of the game has to be Lucas Farner on the mound, who came in and retired.